This video will show you how to use the live annotation feature in Nearpod. Once you have launched a live lesson in Nearpod, you'll be able to use the live annotation feature. On the left hand side is the teacher side and on the right hand side is the student side so that you can see from both perspectives how this feature works. On the teacher side, I will see the pencil on the bottom right hand side of the screen. When I click on this, it gives me the ability to annotate over any static slide that I am on. I have the ability to draw, highlight, and type as well. You will see as I annotate, the student is also seeing the annotations on their end in real time. Keep in mind, you can always erase and delete the annotations at any time as well. When you are done making annotations, you can click the yellow X on the top right hand side of the teacher screen. This will close out the annotations for both the student and the teacher. The students will be able to resume using immersive reader or listening to audio when applicable. I can open up the annotation at any time and what I had done will be saved. When I progress to another slide, you'll see that the live annotation automatically closed out from the previous slide. And if I want to use live annotation on this slide, I'll have to click on the pencil again. This will open up so I can annotate on this slide now. Keep in mind that this feature is only available on static slides and does not work when you are on an activity or content slide. Please also note that this feature is available for school and district premium plus accounts. Thank you for watching and happy teaching.